to my YouTube channel English with Andra. Friends, today we have a pronunciation lesson. We are going to look at the schwa sound. I know all of you must have heard of it before. It is really common in spoken English. So, among all of the important sounds in English, schwa is the most important because schwa appears in almost every word of English. And learning the schwa sound is also necessary. Because schwa sound will enhance your accent, it will make your sound more natural, and it will make your sound more like a native speaker. Let's get started with it. So first of all, how does the schwa sound like? Well, the schwa is a very relaxed and lazy sound. So throughout this video, we are going to call the sound the lazy sound. So now, let's learn how to make this sound, shall we? So the schwa sound is really easy. First of all, first of all, you need to make sure your jaw, your mouth, and your shoulders are relaxed, and then open your mouth slightly and just release some air, like a, uh, a. Uh. So you don't have to open your mouth wide like a. Ah, it's a. Uh. Okay, so that's all you have to do to make this sound. Isn't that really easy, friends? Now the thing that makes schwa's a little bit complicated is that we cannot see them in written English. We can only hear them in spoken English. So, for example, in words like balloon, problem, profit, rocket. Do you know that all of these words actually have a schwa sound? So now practice with me. Balloon. Here the a is a schwa sound. Balloon. Rocket. Profit, problem. So, how do you know if a word contains a schwa sound? Well, in this case, the phonetic transcription of these words will help you recognize the schwa sound. So, this is the phonetic transcription, and this symbol represents the schwa sound. If you see this symbol in the phonetic transcription, you know it has a schwa sound. So, now practice with me. Balloon. Profit. Problem. Rocket. Now the phonetic transcription will make it very easier for you to pronounce words. Another crazy fact about the schwa sound is that every vowel in English can be a schwa sound. For example, balloon. The A is a schwa sound. Problem. In this word, the E is a schwa sound. Or profit. Here the I is a schwa sound. Or bottom. The O is a schwa sound. And lastly, in the word support, the U is a schwa sound. So now we are going to practice the schwa sound with some words. Okay, so I have 15 words with schwa sounds. I'm going to say them out loud and you have to repeat after me. Let's get started. Index. Problem. Napkin Publish Goblin Picnic Cactus Compact Attic Until Expect Album Misfit Limit Did you notice the schwa sounds in all of these words? I hope you did. Well, now here's again a side note. Schwa sounds often appear at the end of the words. So you'll often see schwa sounds at the end of words like lighter, tighter, sharper, stronger, braver. And these words are basically the comparative form of adjectives. But other words like calendar, agriculture, humor, rumor, center, they also have schwa sounds at the end. So the words that end in O-U-R, E-R and A-R also have a schwa sound at the end. But there are some exceptions. For example, take a look at the word guitar. We don't say guitar. It ends in A-R but friends we don't say guitar. It's guitar. And also you have to take care of the American English here. Because in America, Americans would pronounce this word as calendar, agriculture, or humor, rumor. 
So they had the R sound, but in British we drop the R sound. So they actually have the schwa sound before the R sound. Rumor, humor. I hope all of you now know what the schwa sound is, and as we all can see, it's, it's a really simple sound to make. And if you like this video, please don't forget to leave a like and comment this video. And please subscribe to my channel to improve your accent, to improve your pronunciation and to enhance your vocabulary, to enhance your grammar and to overall learn English. And I'll see you soon in the next video. Bye!